but I thought I'd give you a quick walk around of my 1987 Camaro IROC Z. This car has 74,000 original miles on it. And I've actually had this one for a little over a year and a half. I bought the car from a 76 year old lady and she had bought it in, I think it was 89 or 90 when she got it. And uh, she drove it until like the mid to later 90s and the fuel pump went out of it. And she couldn't find anybody that wanted to work on it I guess nobody wanted to drop the fuel tank and fix it the right way so she parked it on a little cement slab beside her barn and it sat there until last January when I bought it so uh, all the paint was virtually baked off the top of the car um, it was like patina overload so I tore the car all down and repainted it I'm a professional painter, so this is kind of what I do. I just happen to have a love for these things. Um, it's a Tuneport 350 car, automatic. It's got the 327 rear end in it, four-wheel disc brakes. It's the Borg Warner 9-bolt. Um, I had to put a new dash pad in it and uh, put a new headliner and sail panel covers and stuff in it. And just cleaned everything up good. It's got all new weather stripping seals everywhere. But the car needed just a ton of work from sitting that long. It's got a new fuel tank in it and and uh, fuel injectors, fuel filter obviously, fuel pump, uh, brake calipers, rotors, all the rubber brake lines, exhaust, and about everything under the hood. We removed all the smog stuff when we had the engine out of it. Had the transmission rebuilt. So the thing just runs and drives awesome. All the electrical stuff works, crews, all that stuff works. Had to put a new power antenna in it. And it's got all new Phoenix graphics, stripes and emblems and stuff on it. You can start it real quick. So the car's actually loaded up really good. It's got almost seven full rows of RPO codes on the SPID decal, which I don't know if you'll be able to. I got the center console full of junk. So anyways, I just thought I'd give you a quick walk around to this thing. I wish I would have did a walk around video of the car when I got it. That would have been a pretty killer before and after. But anyways, hope you enjoyed.